Yep, got him. Boom, fish on. More for the catch and cook. Got him? Yeah. All right. Big fish. Keeper. Dad didn't film it at the same time. All right, we got fish tacos going on today. Hooked up a little bit of uh, wild caught uh, striper and catfish over the last couple days, fishing with my son. Let's get this going. Fish tacos start with what, Alexander? Three excruciating hours of sitting in the hot sun. Okay, fish tacos start with fish. That's right, you uh, got it. Okay. Thanks, son. All right, so let's open this package up. I like to vacuum seal my fish. I'm not gonna cook it that night. Now we just brought these home the other day. Uh, I actually brought one of them home last night. Um, some local caught delicacy, chicken of the sea, not really tuna. But, and I like to use some paper towels again, just to get up any of this fluid. Hit this with some of my rub that I use on my pork, but I'm going to add a little more salt to it, and I'm going to add some cumin, which I should have some cumin in my, my butt rub, but I don't. All right, so just real simple, hit this with a little bit of salt, a little additional cumin, cumin, and some of my butt rub. On this catfish, I'm gonna get, I'm gonna put my seasoning on the inside, the outside, upside, downside, top, front, back. But on the striper, I'm only gonna get the meat side because we got skin on the other. So that side doesn't get any seasoning. Man, I'll tell you what, this rub sure does smell good. This is the rub that I used on that pulled pork that we just did about two weeks ago. Man, this is good. I'm gonna let this sit for a little bit and then I'll fire up the grill, um, take care of some other prep. All right, real simple and easy here. My fish tacos, I like to set my little grill. I will put a little releasing agent on there, just a little bit of oil. The skin is gonna help keep the fish meat from sticking but this helps everything else just kind of release nice and easy. That catfish doesn't have any skin on it, we pulled that off, so this will help the catfish from sticking also. All right, grill's nice and toasty. Let's get this on. Catfish on first. A little striper. Small pieces here. Throw it all on. All right. Let this go for a little bit. This striper, because it's smaller, it's thinner, it's going to come off quicker. These over here, we might close the lid on in a little bit. All right, let's give these things a look. This little thin one right here. I knew this was going to cook up fast. Mm -hmm. Yep. It's come off right now. That's just a little morsel. And these right here, still got plenty of time to go. What I really want to do is flip my catfish. There. Let that bad boy sit just like that. I think I am going to shut this door down too. I'm going to pull these off, but um, I'll come back for these. But I'm going to shut this door down, get this heat going a little more. All right, let's give it a look. Oh yeah, that rub. Starting to do its thing there, crisp up a little bit. See how it's starting to look a little flaky? A little bit more on this striper, and then we know with this catfish, we got a little bit more till. This is done too, but just because it's thicker. All right? Yeah. What I'm looking for is for this just to be flaky where it just comes right apart a little bit longer. Oh yeah, look at that right there. Nice and flaky. 
just what we're looking for. Oh, this one got a little done. Whew. God. Tell you what, that catfish is looking right. Mm. Yeah, man. All right, a couple things here. One, I'm gonna get that on for my tortillas. Two, pop these bad boys out here. Oh yeah, we can salvage something off that for sure. Pop this bad boy off. Okay, let's check this out. So we've got grilled fish here, a couple tortillas. I don't know about you, but my fish tacos, man. Look at this, I like the way this just flakes right off. Just give a couple forkfuls, and I double up my tortillas. I don't know why, I just that's the way I see everybody else do their little small tacos. But you can just flake some of this, Man, that is perfect, coming right off. Man. Okay. Look at that, perfect. So we'll get that fish in there. I don't know about you, but my fish tacos, I get a little bit of slaw, and I, I go with the dry slaw because I'm not preparing a, a coleslaw for this. Um, but then what I do is, I got a, a Chipotle ranch that I, I make, it's not, it's, it's just a generic ranch, uh, not generic, it's a name brand, but it's just a, a somebody else's ranch, and I'll take a small can of the chipotle peppers, and I'll just blend it, nothing fancy, but man, it does wonders, and I also get a little lime, a little lime squeeze. Get into this, see how we did. Mm. Oh man, that is good. I'll tell you what, striped bass, some of the best fish taco meat ever. Mm. And there's a little kick in the meat from the rub, I think, or it's maybe from the chipotle pepper, but. This Chipotle Ranch is not that hot. It just got the Chipotle flavoring, but um, maybe that kick is from my rub. A little extra cayenne pepper in there, I guess. Yeah, this is delicious. Mm. Well, thanks for coming back for another one, guys. Wild caught fish tacos. Another win. Super easy to do, quick and simple. And you don't have to wild catch fish if you don't have a way to catch fish. You can catch them at the store. They're cheap and easy at the store too. Thanks a lot, guys. All right, guys, one last thing I forgot. Fish tacos in my house, get a side of tots. Let's dig in, baby. Okay. <laughs> I'm eating them already. <laughs> we're, we're rolling. Babe, it's perfect. You're, you look beautiful. Come on, stop cramping. You look great. <laughs> no, you just, you, you're beautiful. Okay, in three, two, one. All right, there she is. Okay. Dive in there, baby. What kind of fish? Catfish, those are the catfish. Whose? The ones that Rich caught. Okay. 
Is there lime on it already? Yep. What do you think? Lime adds some nice flavor. Is that a chipotle? The chipotle mayo? Mayo. Mm -hmm. Or not mayo, but the, the chipotle salsa. Mm-hmm. Yep. What do you think it's about good. it? Any heat? A little bit. I think that's from the rub. Oh, it's good. Um, I think you should warm the tortillas, though. I did. Oh, the grill. I, I, you I need grilled to grill them. Up. I grilled them. Uh, no, you need to make them dark. Er. Okay. Good stuff? It's very good. I mean, but the... No critique on air, okay? <laughs> Hey guys, before we get out of here, and I, I gotta give a shout out to California Public Land Hunter. Uh, Richard Davis is doing some really cool stuff over on that channel, that YouTube channel. And uh, in fact, I was out on the fish bank with him um, when, uh, uh, when we got these, uh, this catfish and the striper. Now, um, he's a longtime friend of mine. We've been hunting and fishing together for, I, I don't know, years and years. But uh, again, wanted to just give a shout out to California Public Land Hunter. Thanks for the invite, Rich. Hooked up with some fish, made some great tacos. Yeah, but I can't get anything hooked up.